But guess what? You know what's going to happen to little Henry? Because he's not already callous and he's not already tainted by the world and he doesn't have hypocrisy and he doesn't try to look good. You know what's going to happen to him? The minute he touches that and feels the pain, he's going to run back to mama, run back to daddy, throw himself in their arms, crying in pain. And you know what mama and daddy's going to do? They're going to have mercy and love and grace for little Henry. He's not going to get a whipping. He's not going to get chastisement. He's not going to be told, I told you. You know what he's going to do? He's going to get ointment. He's going to get, uh, he's going to get whatever can soothe, whatever can comfort, whatever can take away the pain. He's going to get kisses and he's going to get hugs and... See, if we would just stop being proud and arrogant and try to save face, but when we would just go and touch the stove or do whatever, if we would just run back to God and throw ourselves in our arms and say, God, I've hurt myself again. I've damaged myself. I've hurt my family. God, would you save me? Would you forgive me? Would you cleanse me? Oh, God, have mercy on me, God. Would you embrace me again? Would you, would you tell me it's going to be okay once again? And guess what? Henry may hurt for a little while. It may sting for a few days. He may get a little blister. He may have something go on like that. But by the grace of God, he'll know that mama's commandment is love. Daddy meant love. And where do I find love after I failed? Right back at the first place I found love and got the commandment in the first place. Because it's all God's love and grace and mercy. His commandment and also his restoration, his mercy, his grace and his forgiveness. It's all his love for his children. Oh, I wish we could be more like children. Not have to act like we didn't touch the stove. We'll go over here and sizzle our fingers. And everybody sees the smoke coming off your hand. That's the truth, friends. We can all tell when everything's disjointed and somebody's out of sorts. You can see it. We'll put our hand in our pocket and go, and we're hurting like crazy. But we don't want anybody to know what we just did. Try to hide it from others. Try to hide it from God. When what we need to do is say, I just transgressed the word of God and I hurt myself. I need comfort, I need love, I need healing, I need restoration. Where are you going to find it if you don't get it from the body of Christ? Why can't we just come to Christ in his body and say, I hurt myself again? Why can't we find love and mercy and compassion and grace in God's provided way?